Springfield's international singing star, Dusty Springfield. Wonderful. Hello. Oh, that's what they did with all my old jewelry, huh? Uh, <laughs> oh, listen, you know something? We've uh, been so busy rehearsing all week, we haven't had a chance to really talk to one I another. I know, it's madness. I've been dying to talk to you. I've been dying to talk to you. There's so many things I want to know. Yeah, me too. So, let's talk. Uh, <laughs> what do you want to talk about? Oh, uh, anything. Uh, no, no, let's not talk about show business. No. No, huh? Okay. No, no, relax. What do you want to talk Everybody about? Everybody talks about yeah, show yeah. Uh-huh. How do you feel? Fine. How about you? Fine. Fine. Yeah, uh-huh. Uh, oh, uh, What's look, look at the time already. I think I've already done the second number. Do your second number? Yeah, thanks. So. Okay. Well, <laughs> uh, you're going to do your second album? Yeah, I think I'm going to. Well, it's been nice talking to you. Yeah. Yeah, it's been really. good yeah. Yeah. I'll see you later. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs> you know, it's, it's nice, you know, when old friends like us can get together and have a heart-to-heart -heart talk. <laughs> Oh, 
the second time say you forgot your ring. Oh, thank you, Wallace. I feel so undressed without it. <laughs> well, what do you think? How do you like it? Well, it fits. <laughs> Wallace, this is my very favorite. This is the one that I wore when I did the Royal Command performance for Queen Elizabeth. And would you believe I was the only one there with one like it? I do believe you, sir. <laughs> well, I know you're very conservative, Juanis, but you see, if you want to get ahead in show business, there's one thing that every great star in show business absolutely needs. Am I getting through to you? What is that, sir? Well, let me show you. If you peruse the people in the news, the people that the magazines all mention, ones bring to everything they do. Listen, and we'll illustrate for you. What may Garbo great? Why does Bardo rate? Dietrich scintillate their grammar. When Sophia Loren Wiggles her Roman nose. That's a nose. Fifty million men shout, Ma, Ma, Mia. Bim, Zha, Zha, Gabor. Gaily takes the floor. All her husband's roar. She, she has grammar. Why did Dick chase Liz all over the hills of Wales? A little bit of grammar never Goldwyn's girls had it. Disney did it with mice. Shirley Temple's curls had it. Sonia Haney did it on ice. We've been looking everywhere, and everywhere we found. Grammar makes the world go round. <laughs> you know, I get stacks of mail from people requesting my beauty secrets. And would you believe some of them are from women? <laughs> How can I help it if I'm in my 14th year of a 10-day beauty plan? <laughs> of course, when you think of glamour, you automatically think of the movie. Well, I was up for the leading role in Cleopatra. It's just too darn bad Richard Burton got the part. <laughs> Good evening, I'm standing here at London Airport awaiting the arrival of a brand new movie star. Picked from thousands of contestants to play the lead in a new Hollywood spectacular. And here she is now, and doesn't she look absolutely gorgeous? Hello, hello. Now tell me, how do you feel about playing the lead in I Love Lassie? Speaking of 
Speaking of glamour, I tried the new pale look. And the first time I wore it, I was followed home by an undertaker. But what really worried me were the vultures. <laughs> by golly, they know. <laughs> but some women will go to any lengths to make themselves good at it. Are you quite comfortable, Miss Martin? Oh, yes, thank you. Perfect. Shall I send the bill? Yes, if you would, but don't bother to wrap it. I'll just wear it home. <laughs> In the last ten years, men's fashions have become as glamorous as women's. Richard Burton has a mink coat. Peter Sellers has a caftan. And for the very last word in glamour, there's always libera. <laughs> How do you like it? It's real seal skin, and it comes with the craziest accessories. Glamour all the time. 